guys, so um, today's video is I'm going to be doing this uh, beautiful makeup look uh, inspired by this queen right here. Um, and yeah, I'm going to try to do like a little series on my channel, like trying to recreate, recreate and do some, you know, Instagram makeup because I secret I am not that creative with my makeup and I'm just like copying people so and I love makeup so like I have this idea that if I just keep working you know like trying to recreate other people's makeup then eventually I will be brave enough to do my own looks I mean I do my own looks most of the time but like these crazy colored looks I don't have that much any ideas so yeah I'm just going to try and recreate as many as I can and yeah guys that's it, let's get on <laughs> with the video. Okay, so we are up close and personal where you can see all my redness, all the pimples in all the places. And yeah, let's get started. Also, here is my little bald spot that I accidentally cut off. I mean, I was trying to wax my brows and then the wax dripped and I cut off my eyebrows. But that is why we're going to fill them in. So I'm going to use my Maybelline Total Temptation Brow Definer in medium brown. Um, and yes, I'm just going to fill in my eyebrows really randomly because then I go in and clean them up um, the best that I can. Okay, so we have them filled. Okay, so I'm, now I'm gonna take my concealer and clean them up. Um, my I, I have eyebrow hairs. I don't have like sparse eyebrows. So I just just quickly fill them in. Um, and I'm just gonna take the Rainforest of the Sea Tarte Concealer in the shade Light Neutral. Can you see this? And I'm going to take my Luxie 245 Small Shader Brush um, just to, you know, clean them up. have them all shaped I'm just gonna take a dense concealer brush and just buff it out now finally I'm gonna take the brow gal uh, gel brown just set them really quick I think you are crooked I think I fixed it I don't know. Um, and now for concealer, I'm just going to take my, not concealer, um, eyeshadow base. This is a white um, liquid eyeshadow from Wet n Wild. Um, and I'm just going to use that as, uh, wait, I have a little eyelash on my eyelid. Okay. Just, just dab it on the eyelid for as an eyeshadow base. And I'm just going to blend it out with the same concealer brush. <laughs> And then to set that, I'm just going to use the shade Crying on My Couch from the Mini Controversy palette, which is very close to my skin tone on my eyelids. So just to set that with a very big fluffy brush. Okay, now for the fun part, the color, I'm just going to take, um, again, a Luxie 239 Precision Shader Brush this one and I'm just going to take the color <laughs> wow which is the yellow one right here um, and just pack it on my lid okay so now I want it a little bit darker I'm just going to take a uh, suck which is this orange one and lightly just apply it on top of that yellow very tiny amount we don't want it to turn orange or anything just a little bit of darkness
Okay, and then I'm just going to go back again with Wow and try and get as much pigmentation as I can on top of that orange. Then I'm just gonna take a Morphe fluffy brush. I don't know um, the name, it doesn't have a name. I bought it in like a pack of 25. So this one, <laughs> and I'm just gonna take Cone right here this color and just blend out the edges because again it's like a skin it's like a my skin tone kind of shade so just to blend it out even like it doesn't need that much blending anyways okay so quickly with a little pencil brush again from morphe i'm just going to take the color jawbreaker and use that as a brow highlighter And then I'm just gonna take a little bit of lemon drop right here and again like put it towards the inner part of my brow like this area okay so now that we have our top eyelids mostly done um, I'm going to take uh, my elf putty primer and I'm just gonna apply it you know with my beauty blender because I find it very difficult to get it out of the pot <laughs> take my elf naked stay naked foundation in the shade 40 wy um uh, clearly i need another bottle soon i love this thing so i'm just gonna apply it on my face okay so now for concealer i'm gonna use the same uh, Tarte Rainforest of the Sea concealer that I use for my brows and to set it I'm just going to use my Huda Beauty uh, Pound Pound cake. No, um, what's it called? Easy Bake Loose Bake This powder in the shade Pound Cake to quickly set my under eyes because they crease like nobody's business <laughs> So now we have our baking going on. I don't let it um, set for too long. I'm just going to just quickly dust it away. And then use the excess powder for, you know, the rest of my face. Because we oily girls need all the powder we can get. <laughs> okay, now to finish um, the eyes, mostly, I'm going to take a bubble gum again. Not again, but I'm going to take bubble gum with a little flat uh, brush and I'm just going to apply it heavily in my under eyes. And then I'm just going to drag it like a little bit underneath that um, yellow that we have on top. <laughs> Okay, and now I'm just gonna take a little bit of Good Morning, blend it out a little bit, just that we don't have that harsh uh, line, you know? And now, because I'm extra, I'm just gonna take Cotton Candy. I just dip my finger in another shade, that's great. And I'm gonna like apply it in the inner most bottom corner. <laughs> love a little bit of glitter and it's in my eye it's in my eye and then I'm just gonna wipe that off and for the like upper part I'm just we're gonna cover that anyways and I'm going to take gumdrop again lemon drop sorry and then like do the upper inner corner okay and I'm just gonna take my NYX white pencil liner I'm done I'm just going to line my waterline <laughs> Okay, eyes watering, waterline done. Um, and now what do I do? Okay, let's finish up the face. 
I'm gonna take my really loved and beloved Too Faced Chocolate Soleil tiny sample bronzer and use this as bronzer and contour with uh, this large angled brush from uh, Farah, F-A-R-A-H. Okay, to match the eyeshadow a little bit, I'm just gonna take this e.l.f. blush in the color Pink Passion, and I'm just gonna blush up my face, and a girl loves blush, so be prepared. Okay, because I just love that, um, you know, sun-kissed look. I'm just gonna take for highlight from the Anastasia Dream Palette, the shade Unicorn, this one right here, and just go in with the highlight. Do not fear it. Embrace it. And um, before we finish the eyes, I'm just going to go in with that same white eyeshadow and do like little white uh, freckles real quick with just a simple eyeliner brush. Okay, so now for eyeliner, I'm just gonna use my Too Faced sketch marker in the color black, I believe. Is that the color? Charcoal. Charcoal black. And because she wants a very big wing, we are going to use uh, the Beauty Blender Liner Designer. If I can get it open. So, you know, just that we can get an even line. It's just uh, like a stencil that you place and then you, you use it as a stencil and it works perfectly because um, I can never get them in the right direction. I'm just gonna use this real quickly out of camera because I need to be face up with my mirror and that cannot happen if I had you here in my face, right? Okay, so please ignore the fact that even with that shield thing, I messed it up. So it looks pretty from afar. Let's keep it a distance and we've got it. Um, now I'm just going to set my face with uh, my milk makeup blur spray real quick okay so I'm just going to apply some mascara curl my lashes apply um, some mascara which is the total temptation by Maybelline and then I'm just gonna apply lashes and I'll be right back okay so while I wait for my other eyelash to dry um a fun fact of the easiest way that I have found to apply eyelashes I buy the the one with the brush and I just apply it to my lids and it's super easy and I, I don't know because I always tend to get them like they don't get to stick in my inner corners but with this they're like on in like 10 seconds and I love it I'm just gonna do that with the with the other eye and nobody has to know you know okay guys so yeah this is the look how do you like it? Mm, I just used on my lips the Jeffree Star uh, Romeo and a little bit of a Ryland on the center for, you know, just a little bit of a dimension to it. Um, so yeah, here's the finished look. I love the little um, freckles that I did. Um, I know it's not part of the original look, but you know, inspiration and I wanted to make it a little more fun, not only just pink everywhere. Um, I am very tempted to just keep applying blush. I have a problem, but it's cute, it's cute. So yeah guys, that was today's video. I hope you guys liked it. Um, comment down below any other type of video ideas that you guys wanna see. Please subscribe, um, give this video a thumbs up. Really appreciate it, comment anything you like and yeah just stay tuned in this channel because i'm planning to do a lot more makeup and a lot more videos in general so comment down below any 
any video idea that you guys want me to do and I will try and fulfill them for you guys. So yes, that was it. Let's, let's just fix the hair a little bit. So yeah guys, um, I have this little bow because um, my roots are very grown and my hair is very washed out so I need a retouch. It will be soon. But yeah guys, that's everything. Um, again, hope you guys liked it and I'll see you later. Bye!